I, uh, I personally believe that every good film has to teach us some good things and some things maybe that we want to avoid in our lives. So it has to talk to the people who live in our day or also in the future because films stay for a very long time and we watch them over and over and maybe in 50 years someone sees it and they still have hopefully something to learn from it. So this film has a moral. The story has a moral to tell. And uh, the moral is that uh, uniting people unites the universe. If there is a one word that would describe this film, this word would be help. Uh, the hero and villain groups of characters work to help each other, to compensate for each other in a group. Uh, they don't act alone, but in unison. And uh, if there were two more words, then these would probably be love and freedom. Uh, help drives love to freedom, and that results in power. The mean people in the world are distracting and enchanting the world to a mysteriously impersonal and phony kingdoms uh, to addictions, to elitist society, to something we don't really want to be part of. In the film we are reminded to be aware of the false conceptions and wake ourselves and our loved ones from these uh, falsities, from the dimensions to reality and see the big picture. So we should notice that there are evil forces in play in the real world and we need to do something about it. It is not all just happy family. Definitely there is uh, too many neutral onlookers, people who don't do much and that is probably the biggest sin of our time, that the sin of omission, the sin of not doing enough, not doing what we should be doing. So we need to change ourselves to be willing to fight for ourselves and for our community.